When using the conservation of energy to solve a system problem, what needs to be considered? Select two answers. The initial energy of the system. Well, let's look at what the conservation of energy says. It says the initial energy of the system equals the final energy of the system. And that, it, that takes place when there's no external work applied to the system. The work energy equation reduces to E initial equals E final. So if you just look at these first two uh, selections, that's it, A and B. Now, why doesn't C and D work? Well, the internal applied forces are explained by Newton's third law. They will all cancel out. So neither their direction nor magnitude really counts there. So the answer is A and B.